So as we walk towards the vehicle, check that it's sat correctly so we can see if there's any obvious problems with the tyres or suspension. Quick look down and underneath, is there any sign of any leaks, fuel, oil, water? Check all the lights, including my side repeaters of course. All the lights are on and working. Any signs of obvious damage? Have a look at the windscreen from the outside and just check the wiper blades for condition. So coming round, check for anything insecure or damaged. Sharp edges, check the middle secure. Side repeater, uh, moving down to the tyre and wheel. Same checks on every wheel now. Check the tread for adequate tread all the way across. Any signs of damage, cuts, exposed cords, that kind of thing. Any signs of severe damage to the wheel. Check the wheel nuts for security. Tire pressure looks okay and it's sat right. The suspension looks good. So we've checked the door shut securely. As we come down the side, just seeing if anything's likely to fall off the vehicle, any sharp edges that might injure any other road user. As we're walking around, if we can see underneath, it's a good idea to have a quick look underneath to see if anything's loose, falling off, insecure. If there is, report it. Even if you don't know what it is, tell somebody about it. Don't take the vehicle out until you know it's safe. Okay, so once we've done that, same checks all the way along, anything damaged, insecure. Coming around the rear of the vehicle, same again. See if anything's loose, insecure. Check the lights, our number plate secure and our number plate lights are working, our side lights are working, fog light, indicators and stop lamp on, off, check the rear doors open, and check your loading area, any loading there is secure and that it's safe for you if you're getting in and out, you're not going to fall over anything, all the panelling is secure. We've got a side loading door. Check that opens, works on its runners, and check your step area, and everything's safe and secure in there. Check that that door operates correctly and closes securely. Onto the fuel cap. Check the fuel cap seal, and there's no sign of any leaks. So from the fuel cap, you're onto your passing your door. Check for any signs of damage or sharp edges. Check it opens, operates and closes securely. And you could check the other passenger seat belts and seat while you're there. Check the mirror, the same checks on the tire. Check the side repeater. And then we're round to the front. Under the bonnet, we need to check our levels. So brake fluid level. On this, we've got power steering fluid, water and washer make sure they're topped up before you leave and then look for any obvious signs of leaks damage anything that doesn't look right report it and get it looked at if you're not sure check your oil level which we've already checked fan belt and see that it all looks uh, correct anything that's not right report it and get it checked